What's up, guys? I wanted to bring you all my favorite, that's right, my favorite wizard. People ask me all the time, they're like, what's your favorite wizard? This is my favorite go-to wizard, and if you guys are looking for a device that can run these wizards, I have several links below in the product description in, in this video description below that links it straight into Amazon. By using those, it helps me out, so check those out. And if you're looking for a good device, those are every device that I currently use. So first, we're going to go into your file manager. We're going to click add a source. Now, I am using a mouse, and it will be a little slow. And if I go a little fast for some of you guys, that's what that pause button is for. First, you're going to go and you're going to put in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash fusion dot tv and we're going to put in add-ons and be sure you put these in correctly that way everything works properly tv add-ons dot ag okay now we're going to name it we're just going to name it fusion just for sake of argument that way we know what we installed we're going to click ok then we're going to click the home button we're going to go into system Go to add-ons, and this is a fresh start, so always do a fresh start. Install from zip file. We're going to click on Fusion. This is where you start here. And the hub wizard. Now these numbers can change, so keep that in mind. And this depends on how fast your system is on, how fast it downloads, and everything like that. So first, you're going to go back home, go to program add-ons, go into the configuration wizard. Now, if you're using Windows, you will, of course, want to use Windows. If you're using a Mac, Android, Apple, iDevices. But I'm using an Android device, and this goes for anything like your Amazon Fire Sticks, Amazon TV, we'll use Android. So we're going to say OK to allow it. Now, here's another. If your Internet's fast enough, or your device is fast enough, that's why I left you the links below. Check those out. They're pretty cheap. I have them down there for from, what, around 40 50 and economy that work great, excellent, all the way up to the top 4K device. So be sure to check those out. And we're allowing the configuration wizard, it's downloaded. We're going to let it do its installation. They usually have pretty fast servers. Um, and your device, it, you know, like I said, it depends on how fast your device is. So we'll let this install. And once this gets installed, we'll be right back. All right, guys, we're at 100%. It is totally installed. It's going to say installation complete. You're going to click OK. Now we're not done here. What you're going to want to do, and this is the same for every wizard that you ever install. So if you never watch another video of mine, be sure you always do this. Always go to your power options and exit. Allow it to reboot. It rebuilds the cache in the system. And we'll be right back once we reboot. Alright guys, we have rebooted her up. And we're back sitting here. You're going to be presented with some intros. It, it's going to change from time to time. And I just click dismiss. You're going to see a lot of things updating. You're going to see a couple that might have an error here or there. That happens. We're going to let this sit here for a couple of minutes. It's always best. But this is my favorite add-on out of every wizard is this wizard here. This wizard here has always been my go-to for most of the things I use. And you can see here it's still building cache, but we're going to look through. You have your videos. You can go into your add-ons area here, and it's going to populate. You can change the view. Uh, the view is not hard to change. You can change. This is set up for info. But you can click that and go down, and you can scroll through. You have everything from sports to YouTube to live TV, which is, I mean, it's, it's got about everything that you could ever want. I mean, just about everything you could ever want. You've got music. Back to your programs. I'm going to show you guys a little trick here, too. In the maintenance tool area, go into your maintenance tool. And we're going to say continue and say OK. Now, once this loads in, we're going to go into the system tweaks. And once this populates, we're going to go into the enable zero cache setting. And what this does is this allows your video to load so you don't have to play two or three minutes and it slowly loads 30 seconds. This will download the whole movie while you're watching it. It'll allow it to keep downloading. 
So be sure to go in there and enable zero caching. Or cache. Cache. Whatever you want to call it. I hope these videos are very tutorial for you. And I leave this video a thumbs up. Hit that like, share, subscribe for more Cody Wizards. Again, I appreciate it. Feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. Until next time, you guys, take care.